What's going on YouTube? I am the goods on YouTube. TG so good everywhere else. Today I'm going to show you how to install Blender 2.79B. That's an older version of Blender. I do have a more updated version of Blender that I also use, but today I'm focusing on 2.79B because I need to go get it. Let's jump into how to install and also how to install the plugin that go with it that allow you to import cyberfaces. Let's go. First thing first, you want to search on Google or the search engine of your choice for Blender 2.79b so let's search for it i'm just going to click here if i scroll down it says download blender 2.79b that's old that's fine with me i'm going to look for my version which will be blender dash 2.79b windows 64 zip once we are done downloading the file should appear in your downloads folder or wherever your downloads go there it is for me i just double click on that then inside there's going to be another folder from there you want to open up another window you want to go to your main drive which for me is my windows c drive i'm going to click on program files uh, then if there's not already a folder you can make a folder called blender foundation and you can drag and drop there from there we can go back to our downloads folder we can delete the download zip file we no longer need that. That will allow us to close this window. Now we just have this window. We can click on Blender 2.79 folder here. Now, now we need to go and get another download. So watching my original video from 2019, I realized I have a Google link. Include that link down in the description. You want to download this folder here as well as download these add-ons here. And they're going to appear in your downloads folder. So I know I told you to close your downloads folder, but guess what? You need to bring it back. Once we have this Let's double click on the one that says MBA underscore tools. Double click. There's a folder in there that just says MBA 2K underscore tools. We want to drag that over, drag it into this folder. Basically, we're going to click continue. Bam. It's there in no time. Great. All right. From here, we want to go back to our main drive. For me, that's the C drive. So I click on that. You want to click on users. Then you want to click on the user profile that you're currently using. Then you want to click on app data. If you can't see app data, you want to click on view and then you want to click uh, hidden items right here. See, I can't see it, but when I do click hidden items, app data shows up. Click app data, click roaming, I want to find Blender Foundation. Then you want to click the Blender folder. I'm just going to create a folder called 2.79. All right, so once we have this folder named 2.79, we want to double click it. And then we want to create a new folder inside of it. We're going to call this folder scripts, S-C-R-I-P-T-S. -E then we want to double click that folder. We want to create another folder called add-ons, A-D-D-O-N-S. And then we want to double click that one. We want to come back over to where we were at the downloads. Go back to your downloads folder. All right, once you're at the downloads folder, you want that other zip folder that you had called blender add-ons for 2k double click that it's going to have five files in there click and select them all and then drag them over to the add-ons folder all right everything is copied since everything is copied i'm going to go ahead and close my downloads folder i'm going to also open up blender 2.79 i'm going to go to file i'm going to go to user preferences from there i'm going to go to add-ons then i'm going to select user and we have three options here you want to select all three of those options click 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 then you want to click save user settings save your settings hopefully they say anyway should be saved all right assuming everything's saved from there we should be able to click file then click import the bottom of import is going to say nba 2k model that's for if you want to import models from nba 2k 14. anyway then if you click over here the scene file all right we're going to close some of these views we don't need to see everything but down here we have nba 2k xx importer panel you can click in the right corner of that area and hold your left mouse button and drag it to the top if you want now you can import a model from nba 2k 23 Okay, so that is the tutorial for installing Blender 2.79B as well as installing the script add-ons. Now I'm going to attempt to test everything that I've done 
by importing a body model. So the first thing I want to do is if your screen looks like this, double tap A, and then click delete, then select delete there, everything's gone. Now you want to come over to the right side, want to click on this little folder icon, then you would need to find a file, uh, I'll probably, I've done videos on this before, but I, maybe I can make another one. Finding a file to use, because I have plenty on my desktop, I'm going to click highhead.scne. This will only open up SCNE files. I click that and I click import. Let's see what happens. Bam, there's a body model there. There's something going on with him. He looks a little weird, but he is there, as you can see. If I click five, it changes the view. Uh, five on the numpad. Five on the numpad. Number pad changes the view. Then I click one. Click control one, turn them around, click three to the side, control three. This is just using the number pad. If you don't know what the number pad is, you can just Google it. That's on you. Anyway, this worked uh, as far as exporting. Uh, uh, maybe I can do another video. Uh, I'm tired. All right, bye.